everybody in here sitting in the tiny house and it is dark and it's rainy good thing it's not very cold um, I don't even have the wood burning stove going but the chickens are tucked in and it has been raining all day long I let the chickens out for a little while and uh, yeah a couple got out so I just let them all free range for just a little while until it started really coming down hard and yeah, they skedaddled all back up into the coop, so that was a good thing. Uh, I've let Betty out a couple times. She's sitting here looking at me right now like, Mommy, I want to go outside, but it's raining. <laughs> it is raining. So I've got nothing done today except from doing some catching up on some reading and learning some new recipes that maybe I'm going to share with you. I haven't got the apple butter started. I was going to start it inside the tiny house, but um, and somebody left me a comment too that I should do it out in the rocket stove. I had planned on doing that, but the rain has just been too terrible, and um, I just don't feel like sitting outside in the rain all day, you know. So I may try and do it inside tomorrow. Thing is, it's going to rain all day tomorrow too, so hopefully it'll be just a little bit colder so that I won't totally roast myself in this tiny house um, but it's gonna take like I said like six or eight hours to get that um, applesauce that I've got I, I'm making it from canned applesauce I've done it before and it turns out great um, it kind of saves you one step if you've already got it the apples cooked down to um, the applesauce stage so I really done nothing today. I got caught up on some uh, like old people I used to follow years ago, and they're still doing the same thing, <laughs> talking about the same things. And you know that's why I don't um, follow them anymore. Blogs, that is, uh, not YouTube, not not YouTubers. So yeah, I've I've really kind of changed over the years. Over the things that I like, I the the people I like to follow. I mean, these days, it's got to be a positive message. You know, it just has to be a positive message. Um, I don't have to agree with you on everything, you know, politically or whatever. But whatever it is you're saying, it's got to be for the greater good, you know. And uh, so, yeah, some of these people I used to, you know, really pay attention to. <sighs> yeah, so things have changed. Anyway, so tomorrow's going to rain all day. I'm probably going to be inside all day long, too. Hey, Judy, I'll give you some love. And that, that means the chickens are probably going to be inside the coop all day, too. I let them out for a little while, run around uh, when there's breaks in the rain and whatnot. Um, but Rudy has been doing, uh, not Rudy, I, I call him Rudy because when I had my old property and I was living mm -hmm. in my van, I was parked um, on my property. My next door neighbor had a chicken and a rooster and they'd come over and I'd feed them and stuff, and, and that rooster's name was Rudy. So, Romeo. Romeo has been taking very good care of the girls, and that makes me so very happy. But I did want to let you know that I have started a blog, and uh, actually I, I've had the blog for years. I just never did anything with it. So, I'm going to start putting up some writings. Um, I will start, you know, writing about things because I like to do that too. And I'll leave the link down below. It's just on Blogspot, so... Um, and also I have uh, Instagram now too. I just started Instagram so I'll put the link down below too. You can all also find the link. Um, oh, I haven't had added the Blogspot link yet. I'll add that to my About page. The Instagram is on my About page. The link, you just hit the About link on my channel. Scroll all the way down and you'll see it. So, I don't know, maybe tomorrow I'll get that apple butter started. I really want to do it because I love apple butter and I haven't had some in so long. And it's always best homemade, it really is. So, yeah, this is just a quick update. Nothing too interesting. I hope you are all doing well. And, you know, another thing, thank goodness Miss Donna sent me those uh, word search puzzles because I've been doing those too. And um, I'm trying to find a recipe that can kind of replicate the um, pickles that Teresa sent me. They were like spicy bourbon pickles. I want to pickle some eggs. And I did pickle some eggs. I finished all those pickles and they were delicious. And um, I just ate something. So, I mean, it was really good and spicy and stuff. Um, 
I ate all the pickles, and I did pickle some eggs in the brine, but I have no more brine left. So I'm trying to find a good recipe for spicy bourbon pickles, which means I'm going to have to get some bourbon. Or I wonder if, like, cheap whiskey would work. <laughs> I don't know. Bourbon's kind of expensive. Anyhow, uh, so, yeah, I'm looking for a recipe to do that. Maybe I'll do that tomorrow. I don't know. Um, but just keep me in your thoughts because these next this day next day the next 24 hours is going to be hard because it's going to be pouring down rain all day again and i worry about the chickens out there in the van all cooped up you know who wants to be cooped up in a in a van <laughs> i was cooped up in that van for almost a year basically a year so anyhow i'm just blabbing I just want to do a quick update. Hopefully this will upload in time because the internet is not great. And um, in the meantime, look at some pretty mushrooms I found. Well, that's all I got for you. See you in the next video. Thanks for watching, everybody. I hope you enjoyed the video. Make sure you like, subscribe, hit the bell, and y'all have a good one.